Welcome to the first episode of Marketing Spark, a podcast delivered in small doses that puts the spotlight on insight, tips, and stories from marketers and entrepreneurs in the trenches. By small doses, it's conversations that are 15 minutes or less. It's content that is easy to consume and user-friendly. Think of it as a snack rather than a meal. This format embraces the concept of micro-marketing, marketing designed to quickly deliver value. It's mini podcasts, 30-second videos, blog posts less than 200 words, and super short and sweet social media updates. Now today, people are multitasking. They're scanning, not reading, and they're doing more with less. They want to consume content, but there's simply not enough time in the day. And that's the beauty of micro-marketing. Less is more. On Marketing Spark, you'll hear from marketers on how they're operating amid challenging times. What are the tools, channels, and approaches that they're using to engage and attract customers? What have been their most successful campaigns, and what did they learn from their failures? As for why I've jumped on the podcast bandwagon, well, here's the backstory. I lost my job as the VP marketing of a SaaS company in late April. Not exactly the best time to be out of work. Now, out of the blue, I got a message on LinkedIn from an Australian digital marketer, Jamie Stenhouse. We had a good chat about a unique and low-cost model that he uses to do sales outreach for his digital marketing agency. And as we were wrapping up the call, Jamie gave me some great advice. If you're looking for business, simply reach out to all your first connections on LinkedIn. These are people, he said, that I knew, so it made sense to see if there's any value in my connections. So that's what I did. I wanted to connect with people, learn and do research on how I could relaunch my marketing consultancy in the midst of a global pandemic. I've talked to dozens of people, entrepreneurs, marketers, consultants, and investors. And to be honest, it felt like going to marketing school. I could ask questions about anything. And along the way, I realized that these conversations would be great material for a podcast. But I've never created a podcast. As a writer and journalist, blogging has always been my thing. So to test the waters, I posted my podcast plans on LinkedIn and asked if people would be interested in participating. And the response was overwhelming. So I guess I'm now part of the podcast community. I hope that you'll join me on this journey by subscribing to Marketing Spark via your favorite podcast platform. If you have ideas for topics or suggestions for guests, send an email to mark at markevans.ca.